if we talk about the types of spectra a black body which is passed through its prism you got your continuous spectrum if it is a hot dilute gas automatically you got emission spectrum if it is via a black body via a cool gas into a spectrum you got your absorption spectrum so these are the three varieties of spectrum one is continuous emission and this one is absorption spectrum if the slit is illuminated with a light from sodium vapor lamp two images of the slit are obtained in the yellow region of the spectrum these images are the emission lines of sodium which is having a wavelength of 5896 angstrom and 5890 angstrom this is nothing but your spectrum of sodium if we talk about the classification of spectrum the first one is emission spectra the another one is absorption spectra so if your light is passed through a prism you'll get continuum spectrum from the hot gas via the hot gas you got emission spectrum right emits over here from the cold gas you got absorption spectrum now we'll talk about emission spectrum the light emitted directly from your source examined through a spectrometer the emission spectrum is obtained every source has its own characteristic emission spectrum you can see a light bulb via a cool gas via a slit it will hit a prism and you got your emission spectrum here the emission spectrum is of three types a continuous line and band spectrum now we'll talk about the continuous spectrum as i told the spectrum consists of unbroken luminous bands of all wavelength containing all the colors from violet to red this spectra depends only on the temperature of the source in candescent solids liquids carbon arc electrical filament lamps will give continuous spectrum so you are able to see the emission spectrum via the cool gas via the slit it's passed you got emission over here you got your hot bulb slit and directly to the prism you got your continuous spectrum if you talk about line spectra these are sharp lines of definite wavelength it is a characteristic of emitting substance line spectrum is used to identify the gas atoms in the gaseous state that for free excited atoms emit line spectrum the substance in atomic state such as sodium in sodium vapor lamp mercury in mercury vapor lamp and gases in discharge tube will give the line spectra if we talk about band spectra band spectrum consists of a number of bright bands with a sharp edge at one end but fading out at the other band spectra are obtained from the molecules so also you are able to see the hydrogen spectra sodium magnesium hydrogen beta hydrogen r calcium hydrogen and calcium